Hey guys and welcome back to yet another Just Cause 4 video. Today we'll talk about the new redesigned grapple hook. Avalanche this time around made the grapple hook fully customizable, which is going to add so much depth to the game. But before we begin, I want to let you guys know I have a public Discord for my viewers and I live stream six days a week and have viewer games every Sunday. So if you're into that, I do recommend you join my Discord and follow me on Twitch. With all that out of the way, let's begin. So the grapple hook, very iconic piece of equipment in the Just Cause franchise. I mean, if you ask people what makes Just Cause different from all the other open world sandbox games, they would probably say the destruction and of course the grapple hook. In the previous games, the grapple hook had a lot of utility, with more being added with each game. However, the big change in Just Cause 4 is that the grapple hook is now fully customizable. Apparently now you can pretty much customize every aspect of the grapple. You can adjust the airlifters, aka the balloons, the retraction speed and strength and booster strength and much, much more. This is a massive game changer for the franchise. We now have full control of the grapple and can adjust it how we like in order to help with whatever we try to accomplish in the game. Stunts will be infinitely more exciting and complex and just imagine a crazy and creative grapple destruction you'd be able to pull off with all these new features. Another big addition on top of all of this is that you can now change between three different grapple loadouts on the fly. So you can set up three different loadouts and change them in real time as you're playing the game. That is just insane. It will honestly make everything so much easier and so much more fun in the game. My big issue with stunts in Jesco's 3 was how unpredictable the grapple and tethers would be sometimes, making some stunts extremely difficult and time consuming to pull off. So I actually have for you guys some leaked screenshots of the grapple hook customization menu. So here it is guys, as you guys can see from these you can see in detail the options and aspects of the grapple hook you can customize. I assume this isn't fully developed so expect this to change for the launch of the game. By the looks of things, each aspect of the grapple has presets for you to choose from on the right, as you guys can see, and unfortunately the quality of the screenshot is not the best so it's hard to tell what each of them actually does. Some noteworthy things I can see is that you can set the height that the airlifters reach, also the length and the speed of the retractor, the boosters appear to have an option to be fully disabled, which I think is going to be very interesting, as well as having a 10 second delay on them. Not sure if that delay would be for them to activate or for them to explode like in Just Cause 3. Obviously I have to mention you have the option to edit the mods so that means you can probably tweak small things about each one of these mods so possibilities are truly infinite like they stated in their promotional material. So you guys might be asking how the hell do you know you're gonna be able to change them on the fly? Now in this next screenshot it's another capture of the leaked gameplay and as you guys can see from the bottom right you have the different grapple loadouts for you to switch out. So like I said, you can switch them on the fly, making the stunts even more exciting and elaborate. Honestly, Just Cause 4 is packing so much content, I cannot wait for the release of the game. So in order to switch them, it looks like you just have to press, I think it's called the D-pad? I'm not exactly sure. Just hold it or just like press it. I don't know, I don't really play an Xbox. I've got one, but I never use that thing. I'm more of a PlayStation and a PC guy right now, so that's kind of what I'm gonna stick to. I'm not trying to start a console war in the comments, so please, okay, keep that out of my comment section. Probably shouldn't have said this, but anyway, it's out there. So I wanted to ask you, what do you guys think of all of this? Obviously, we can only see the icons of all the mods, so we don't really know what they do. We can only speculate for the time being. I do assume we're gonna get a little bit more information closer to the release date, because I think it is a major part of the game that the iconic grapple hook and tethers can now be fully customized. But that is gonna do it for this video kind of short and sweet showing you guys the customization of the grapple hook in Just Cause 4. So if you guys enjoyed this, make sure to leave a like on this video, subscribe if you're new to the channel. But thank you guys so much for watching, I hope you're gonna have a wonderful day, and I'll see you guys next time. Take care, goodbye, bye 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 bye.